night, good afternoon. So uh, Sunday the 21st of April, happy Easter. Uh, so we uh, are spending the afternoon out here on this gorgeous day, um, out in the garden trying to, in the backyard, trying to get things prepped. Uh, so we've already pulled out all the water lines uh, from the garden um, and I'm going to pull out some of the posts here. A little bit about the garden here, it's uh, roughly 24 wide, about 34, 35 long. Um, we're starting to get some showers coming in here so I'm going to do this quick. Um, so one thing wanted to uh, just kind of go over was, um, so I picked this uh, up, um, it's a post, a T-post puller. Um, got it at Tractor Supply, it was like $10. Um, so gonna demonstrate um, how I use it. So back here I've got, these are 10 foot tall uh, T-posts. Uh, this is what we have been using for um, our tall trellises for um, growing snap peas, tomatoes. Um, this year we're gonna do pole beans on them. Um, so we use these posts and then we put a fence panel on here. Um, we drive them roughly two feet in the ground and that leaves eight foot sticking up um, and then put an eight foot panel, uh, fence panel on them. So, uh, so here's how this works. So I've got my handyman Jack here. Um, so the, uh, the kind of the triangular shaped side, if you can see that is what slips over the post. Um, and then this side here, you can either put the um, handyman Jack hooked in here or um, you can put a chain in here like if you're using a tractor or a, a bobcat um, to lift it up with a hydraulic loader um, so now I gotta reach to do this because of the, how tall they are but I'll get that up over the top so just like that take the handyman jack I am gonna move this down a bit and I get it down one more yet. Nope, not gonna happen. All right. Get this. It's always easier two handed. I should have lifted the handyman jack up a little bit. The fence doesn't like me doing this. Let's try this again. So hook it in and hook it over one of the notches um, of the T-post and hook the back side um, in to the handyman jack. And then simply operate the jack. And Now I don't pull them all the way, I just get them up so that they're nice and loose, and then I can lift it up. Now, tractor or bobcat, but I don't have that equipment, this is what I got. I used to use a chain, wrap a chain around the post, and put the chain on the handyman jack, but that was almost a two-person operation. This is definitely worth the $10. Um, it makes it to be a one-person operation. So I'm gonna continue on, try to get these pulled out before it rains on us too hard, but uh, you have a good evening and we'll uh, talk to you later.